My name is <coughs> Menard Mtenerwa. I'm employed full-time by the National Blood Services Zimbabwe. My project title uh, with DPDM, that is the Diploma in Project Design and Management. The title of my project was uh, Utilization of Blood and Blood Components at Parrenya Atwa Hospital. What motivated me to do this project uh, was uh, to find out if blood and blood pro products were being efficiently and effectively uh, utilized by Parenyatwa Hospital. Parenyatwa Hospital is uh, one of the five central hospitals in Zimbabwe. So uh, if I <coughs> find out how blood and blood products are utilized at Parenyatwa Hospital, it would give me an indication of uh, the uh, scenario in the whole country. The products that uh, I was looking at were whole blood, fresh frozen plasma, uh, platelets, cryoprecipitates, and immunoglobulins. The findings from uh, the project has helped the National Blood Services as the procurer and distributor of blood and blood uh, products uh, determine the number of units or the number of blood products that it should uh, procure uh, <coughs> for, 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 for distribution to uh, the hospitals. Before doing the DPDM uh, program or before joining the DPDM pro uh, program, I had just done theory on uh, on project management. I had just done theory on research. I had not uh, done, uh, I, I didn't have experience in going through the whole research uh, protocol, starting from uh, the idea generation to writing the project proposal, taking it, it through to for ethical review. So in my case, I had to come up with this, I, I had to identify a problem first, uh, come up with an idea, uh, develop that uh, idea into a proposal. And when I did my proposal, I then took it uh, through for, uh, to the various departments that were uh, supposed to approve my uh, project, starting with my employer, National Blood Services Zimbabwe. I got the approval and the go ahead that I should, I, I can do the project. I then went to uh, JREC, uh, Joint Research Ethical Committee, that is uh, the Joint Research Ethical Committee, which is a joint of uh, Parinyatwa a group of hospitals and uh, the University of Zimbabwe College of Health Sciences. My project was approved there. And then after that approval, they do it uh, on for students. They do it on behalf of Medical Research Council of Zimbabwe. It was uh, after the project had been approved that I then started working on uh, the data collection. After data collection, I then uh, analyzed my data uh, with the assistance of uh, a biostatistician. Then after the analysis, I then had to look at my results and did my write-up so that I can share that um, information with others. This is a tremendous experience that I was uh, uh, waiting for and looking forward to have all these years that I have been practicing medical laboratory uh, sciences. And uh, looking ahead into the, uh, into the future, uh, I am now confident and I can now do uh, a project or a research, a, a, a full, a complete scientific uh, project use, uh, following all the protocols that are internationally accepted. So I'm now a proud researcher, medical laboratory scientist, a researcher who is now able to do research on his own, thanks to uh, the T-REC program.